What's good, YouTube? It's your boy Almighty Max, and today we're back to the Carton Arcs, man. Uh, if you're new here, drop a like, subscribe, what's the 10k? Let's get straight into the video, man. Tears. This free spirited young lady, I believe, is doing the thing that we always see when people park at the very far end of the parking lot is they, they want all the space. If you're confused right now, but they also don't. And you don't know what I'm watching? It's basically a dude that like goes around. If you leave your carts to, like laying around, He'll go over there and tell you, like, yo, like, can you please put the cart back? And, and most, you would think, if you're a normal human, you just put the cart back. But apparently, these NPCs nowadays be wildin'. They don't put the cart back and actually start raging. And he gets some good content out of it. So, uh, yeah, I found the guy through TikTok. So, first I'm watching one of his full videos. Don't want to take the walk back. Oh, she's closing her door, even. We've skipped wheedle deep through page of Cameron here with the cart narcs. That's not where the carts go. That doesn't, that's not where the cards go. No, but there are people, they pay people. To okay, pay the man. Let me explain. We hear this all the hey, time. Bro, what? So that means because there's garbage men and the city pays people for pick up trash, you can just throw trash anywhere? Like, no, nah, nigga, like, be a, a decent human being, bro. Like, don't make people's life harder than it has to be, bro. He got to walk all the way from the front of the store to the back to the thing. Like, come on, just put it all together and that's it. Stop being an asshole. Listen, buddy, listen. I get what you're saying. Thank you. I get what you're saying, but. But. There's no, I don't know, you're, they, <gasps> you don't they, care? Oh, she don't go no, for Because they pay people. Well, now, ma'am, do you, money, when you go to the, go it's not sure. good money. I get a kid that I gotta get back oh, to. Oh, is there, is there a kid starving to death or something? No, but, uh, no. They also pay, do you pee on the seat when you use a public restroom? Because they pay people to clean it. that shit up, that's disgusting. That's the same idea. Ah, gotcha. Dude, get a fucking life, man. Uh, the carts are my life, that's why, and don't listen to music while you're in your car, that's not safe, and it's against, uh, uh, I was about to say FAA regulations, DMV regulations. You're not supposed to. Oh, what's she doing? She's taking. That's a bumper man. Oh, no, you now you're littering. Don't be a litter bug. Yeah, I'll put one on the back of your car here for you. Madam. Knock it off right now. now I mean it. I will if you take your cart back. Would you like to do that for me? Knock it off. Knock what off? Be Don't a responsible touch person? my stuff. That's okay. It's for you. See, he's got her phone number on it. You Don't. call bother me right now i mean it because you're bothering people by blocking the spot do you understand the correlation madam you're starting this shit back the fuck off oh, you started shit. with your card ma'am all i did was That's ask you what they pay people for but ma'am what's your leave me the fuck alone Wait. i mean it okay. leave me i got more get the fuck away from uh, me what are you doing bro isn't that crazy how she's probably like 40 something and like, she's acting like a fucking toddler, bro. What the fuck? You're blocking traffic no, now. you're starting shit. Ma'am, you started the poop Do with your- Do not get anywhere near me. I, how about this? Stop, stop. Do you wanna have a conversation, be civil, or do you wanna yell like Do a big old sour touch puss? me. I didn't touch you, I never have. You're touching my shit, stop. And someone else is gonna touch you with, with your cart when they try to pull in there. Stop. Get away. Sir, did you see her, what she did with her cart? Get out of there. See now, you're, you're overreacting. You're falling for her tricks. I'll give you one right there. That's what I'm talking about. It's the carts. Stop it, madam. Would Leave you? Me the bro, fuck you know, away. you know the crazy madam. part is too, bro. Like, if she just let the nigga put the stick on, right? She drives a, a couple miles away, maybe like even out the supermarket, like the nearest thing. She parks and removes it. The whole thing is done. There's no video to be uploaded. She's not embarrassed by how many users she got. By 875,000 people. Feel me? They didn't see her just rage. She feel me? She didn't get the public humiliation. Like, this video does not exist. The she just like got in her car, ignored the dude. Maybe she didn't want to put the car back. Cool. It just ignored the dude, left the car there. Let him put the sticker there and just keep driving. And take it off when you get to like a further destination. That's it, bro. I feel like people don't think in these moments. Like they're really they're really bots, my nigga. Like Silver Naughty's right. There's bots. They're walking bots. Why are you people, why are you reacting this way? Why are you not Leave me alone? Why are you not addressing the life. situation with the cart? You make it harder. Don't come near me again! But I'm not coming near you. Do not come near my car! What about the cart? I don't give, dude. They fucking pay people. I told you Leave the analogy. Do you throw trash on the ground because they pay people to pick that up too? No, they don't pay people to pick it up. Then what are garbage men for? Shut the fuck up and leave you. <laughs> get Adam. away from me. Yeah, that's another thing where you throw you throw some logic at these people. They go insane. Adam, I'm not okay. Tell you what, I will leave you alone if you want to take the cart Stay back. Stay away from me. Madam, you're blocking traffic again dude, here. Dude, do not come near my fucking car. Why are you so angry? Cause you won't leave me alone. Yeah, I will leave you alone. I will leave you alone if you take your cart back. How about that? You don't work for these fucking people. What does that make? Leave okay. me alone. Madam, what difference does that make? Oh my God. It's the principle. Come. Get the fuck away from me. Why are you screaming?
Bro, what's that little stomp she did, bro? She's really a three-year-old, bro. Like, that's like the stomp my little brother does when I let him play Fortnite. Like, he's also his little tantrums. Like, you just stomp. Like, bro, this, this is an example of, like, your life not going well for you. Like, I'm... I'm not a psychologist, but I might as well be. Feel me? I might as well got a degree in psychology. Feel me? This is this is what happens. It's a prime example of everything not going good in your life. Feel me? There's a lot of stress going your way. You got probably got a shitty job. Husband not giving her no cock. Feel me? Like she's she's stressing out in life. Feel me? And uh, it just takes one trigger, one tiny thing, for that huge explosion to happen, bro. It's like those two little atoms connect and just boom, nuclear bomb, nigga. That's literally what happened right now. And we're witnessing live on YouTube, my nigga. Feel me? Like it's kind of it's kind of sad, bro. If you just use her brain. Relax, analyze the situation. That's why a nigga can never world star me. I'm not cap. A nigga never gonna catch me like in a, a viral video, none of that shit. Cause you can't trigger me, bro. I'm gonna think about the situation, and I'm gonna just analyze it. Bro, get in my car, leave the cart there, drive away, take the bumper sticker off when I get farther away, and boom, the nigga not finna upload shit cause he's not good content. Feel me? This is great content. I'm being a nice guy. Amazing content. It's a magnet. It's got our bumper magnet, so they didn't return my shopping cart like a jerk. And that's just blocking traffic too, like. Why are you antagonizing? I'm not antagonizing. Why are people not driving around? You to react and, uh, what's going on here? Get the fuck away from me! What are you doing in your car? Yeah, I'm gonna fucking hurt you in two seconds. Oh, That's against shit. the law, ma'am. What you're doing is harassing me. What I'm doing is being a public servant and helping. Yo, she got the strap. Yo, she strapped up like a dyke sign. What's they doing? You learned your lesson. You're being you a big old. You got your point. No, but you have. I would have my point if you would take your car back. See what you're doing is she's doing a classic thing. By overreacting, ah. by overreacting, what you're doing ah. is trying to give a make yourself into the victim. When everybody with the cards to the victim, <laughs> thank you. Please knock at her. She's being a. Now this nigga's an A1 right, cause troll. Because you're, you're causing a, a public troll. safety nuisance. No, I will stop. I'm about to call the cops. No. No. Let me explain. You don't know the whole story. No. Yes, you do. No. How do you know? I don't care. Yes, you do need I don't to care. care. Because. I don't care. I'm a random person. I exactly. Don't care. That's why I'm no. stopping. Yo, what That's stay why I'm is stopping. this? Okay. Nobody got front bumpers. I want to show like, because she had a whole She's calling stop. Stop. I understand stop. that. I understand that. I don't give a fuck. Madam, don't give a fuck. this is the problem, is you don't want to hear and have a conversation. You just want to yell and scream and be a sourpuss again. Again, but I am cart narcotiers. Go. You might say, oh, what's he doing? CSD? I'm acting responsible. You know who's acting the fool? The person who left their card out. That's who's acting the fool. Sorry, I had to set her straight. Autistic, ma'am. First off, it sounds like you're using that word as an insult. Number one. in Florida. Oh, no, buddy. But that's the wrong state to be doing that shit in, my boy. Do that shit in another state. I mean, there's guns everywhere. Don't get it fucked up. But in Florida, Texas, all these southern states, everybody's strapped. See, the Karens got straps. Everybody here in New York, only real niggas got straps. You feel me? So if you're a real nigga and you're ready to go to jail, you're going to have a strap. But these other niggas over there, bro, ain't nobody going to jail for killing nobody, bro. Like, just the fact that he was antagonizing her, she had, she had enough right to kill you right there in, in Florida, bro. My niece, I have family who's autistic. And, and they, and, and, are they, and are they fans? Autistic, I'm a fan of law and order. Ma'am, people who leave their carts out are mentally disabled. And also, I feel like you're still trying to use that as an insult. Anyway, uh, now, see, now you're being sarcastic. People who leave their carts out because, you know, I worked in a grocery store. So did I, yes. Okay, ma'am. That's the same. Art. Yeah, they also pay people to, to pick up trash. Do you do you litter? No. Do you pee on the seat because they hire maids to clean up after you? When you use a hotel room, do you do you trash the hotel room? They they, they hire maids to pay exactly. up to pick up after you. That's totally Those are. Th no, it's not. Or if we're in a supermarket. Like, do you purposely like spill drinks on the floor? Cause like, if not, the janitor won't have any work to do. Like, no, nah, nigga, don't make people's life harder just cause they pay people to do it. Like, what type of what type of privileged prick shit is that? Like, come on, my nigga. And I know for a fact when she worked supermarket, she was probably like the cashier or some shit. She was not the nigga out in the fields in a, in a hot summer or in a cold winter with hella snow going from point A all the way to fucking... This supermarket big as shit. So imagine going from the front of the supermarket all the way to the back where this nigga's at right now. Just put it back to the auto cart shit, my nigga. And all them carts spread around and shit. Like, that's, uh, that's hard work, bro. I ain't cut, my nigga. That's a little hard work for, like, what, 12 hours? Not then a minimum wage like, seven bucks. So for seven dollars, you finna get three miles of exercise in 30 minutes. Every 30 minutes, you gotta go back out there. Feel me? In a hot, blazing sun in Florida, or if you live in a cold state, the fucking cold winter, like... Exactly similar analogies. Those are people who are paid to clean up after you. Do you want to make their job harder? Ma'am, that's the most... Bro, this is the example of a bitch that's... The, bro, she not, she not ready to listen, bro. She's just like, people just talk, but they're not... Their ears don't work, my nigga. Like, he brought up good, but valid points, but she's not trying to listen to it, bro. Ironic thing you possibly could have said right now. 
because I'm giving you excellent analogies about other people who are paid to, do, do you tell, when they don't you're in this room, do you say, no, oh, you're the parents, you, you, you pay the mortgage so you can clean up after me because it's my, your mess now. Pick up after yourself is all we're asking. They have the cart returns for a reason. Thank you, they should do it, yes! Thank you! No, I said they should do. Should do what? They have cart returns. Yes, that's right, and they shouldn't leave them blocking spots. That's what I'm saying. And I grabbed it and used it, and it was really convenient. Oh, is it convenient to not be able to open your door, ma'am, and to have your door dinged and scratched? How convenient was that? I didn't have an answer for that. All right, I'm getting out of here. <sighs> Asia Cameron out. All right, this nigga's brave. I ain't cop doing that shit, bro. Like, antagonizing people, bro. Like, the shit that nowadays, bro, niggas get triggered over the slightest shit, bro, and they'll take your life over anything, bro. So, me, nigga. Excuse me, I'm saying I'm staying out the fuck the way, my nigga, feel me? Not finna start beef with no nigga. Feel me? Cause niggas will kill you for no reason nowadays. Feel me? Now, she was ready to pull out the strap on him because he told her to park the cart back. Think about that, bro. So if you enjoyed that video, man, drop a like, subscribe, uh, roll to 10K. I might react to another one of his videos. She was kinda lit. I might drop a double reaction to just to this guy, because I fuck with this video so much. Uh, so be on the lookout for that. Yo, and by the way, my boy Nick, shout out to my boy Nick. He hit me up on IG. Feel me? I spoke to him in Discord. He ended up making me a Discord, bro. And that shit is lit, my nigga. So if y'all wanna join the Discord. Let me know down below. I'm going to leave it down in the comments. Like, I'm going to have it as a pinned comment. And I'm leaving the description as well. So, yeah, I can find it in both areas. So, if you can't find it when you find another. So, join the Discord. You can stay up late nights. Well, the days that I'm available because I do have a job. But the days that I'm available, late nights, chop it up. Talk sports. Talk if you watch an anime, film new TV shows. Just hop on the game. Play some 2K. Like, whatever y'all want, bro. We can hop on that GTA. All that shit, bro. So, like, join the Discord. I'm trying to get this shit lit. Feel me? Uh, I said at the end, though, because I only want... The real supporters to join. I just don't want anybody in that. So I don't want niggas that's not gonna be active or niggas that don't really fuck with me. Now I said at the end because I know this is where the real niggas is at at the end of the video. So if you made it to the end, join the Discord. I don't really care if it's one, two, or a thousand niggas that join. I just want the real niggas to join. So that's why I said at the end. Feel me? If you enjoyed that video, man, drop a like, subscribe. Go to 10k like I said before. Don't forget to join the Discord. Support my Max and all. I'm out.